नमस्ते मेरा नाम पृथ्वीराज है आप कैसे हैं सत श्रीकाल सारू की हाल है थोड़ा मेरा नाम रजत है नमस्कार मजा नाव करण मोर है तुम्हें कैसे आ हाय मूल नाम तो अंजीत देखा की खबर आपको नमस्कार हमारा नाम सुमन क्या मना है नमस्कार मूल नाम शुभम तुम्हें कैसे आ अच्छा वेलकम इनडो पेर आमे इंग्लिश पे इट हाय मुझे नाम प्रिया अम तो कशिया सर जैसी कृष्णा वो अभिषेक तुम्हें कैसे हो नमस्कार एंड द पेर प्रिया एंड द प्रेशियस हाय मुझे नाम निकाल नमस्कार ना पेर सुमित मेरे नाम ना राम राम जी मेरा नाम सर प्रदीप कुमार है क्या हाल चाल है तेरा सो वॉट डिड वी हेयर राइट नाउ वेल वी हर्ड द सेम थिंग स्पोकन इन डिफरेंट लैंग्वेजेस एंड ऑल दीज डिफरेंट लैंग्वेजेस वेर इंडियन लैंग्वेजेस नाउ विच लैंग्वेजेस डू यू स्पीक वेल in school you definitely speak in english language but what about your home well you may speak in english language or you may also converse with people using some other language maybe your mother tongue so we all use a number of languages to communicate so i'll share with you a story about three friends who were from different places in india and at home they spoke different languages and because of which they actually faced some problems so the three friends were ravi sadbir and amar now they were best of friends they were always together so once ravi and amar went to sadbir's home now sadbir's mother and father were conversing with sadbir in punjabi and as a result both ravi and amar couldn't understand a word because they did not know how to speak or understand punjabi now the same thing happened with others too that is when satbir and amar went to ravi's house then ravi's parents were conversing with ravi in tamil again both satbir and amar could not understand a single word of it now when satbir and ravi went to amar's place then amar was conversing with his parents in nisi language and as a result satbir and ravi could not understand anything at all so why did this problem occur that's because all of them spoke different languages at home that is their mother tongue was different in fact in every state we have a specific regional language and usually people speak that language in that state and in india there are so many different states and as a result there are so many different languages and that is why all of them faced such problems now the question arises that all the different states lie in the same country india that is we are all indians then why do we speak so many different languages why don't we speak a single language well there is a reason for it now in ancient times people used to live in different parts of india and they used to live in their own groups now at that time there was no transportation or no interaction between these groups as a result all of them developed their own language for communication among themselves right and what happened well as time passed well we started interacting with each other all the states started communicating and transporting between each other and as a result what happened we started mixing so people from tamil nadu started living in delhi people from delhi started living in kerala and in this way the entire population started mixing with each other but their mother tongue remained the same that is their native language remained the same and as a result although now we are 
one single country and we all mix with each other we have different native languages because that language is spoken in our native state that is our originating state and as a result we all speak so many different types of languages but still we all live together isn't it now india has many states and different languages are spoken in different states india has 22 officially recognized languages that is 22 of these languages are officially recognized by the government of india but more than 800 different languages are spoken in india so there are 800 different languages that are spoken in india so india is so diverse how many officially recognized languages are there in india what do you think is it 32 is it 48 or is it 22 well the answer is 22 there are 22 officially recognized languages in india now as you can see in this map these are different languages which are spoken in different parts of india now what do you see in this well the most important thing which you will notice is that this entire region here speaks the language hindi so a very huge population of india speaks the language hindi while there are so many different states in which people speak different languages as you can see now english and hindi have been recognized as the languages for official communication by constitution of india however all the states are free to communicate in their regional language so hindi and english have been recognized as official communication languages but again in every state you will see that regional languages are also used for official communication hindi is spoken by 41 percent of the population in india which is very large majority of people in northern part of india speak hindi in the southern part of india most people speak Telugu, Tamil, Kannada or Malayalam. So India is a diverse country with diverse languages. India is one of the few countries in the world with such a diverse population. Different people speaking different languages are all part of a common country that is India. Despite so many dissimilarities, we stay united and live together in harmony, making India a unique nation. And that is why India is such a unique nation. You can see such diversity in this country. So many different languages, different types of people, so many different states. But still, we all stay united and in harmony. And that is why India shows an example of unity in diversity don't forget to subscribe to our channel you can also register for free at deltastep.com to get all learning resources as per icse cbsc ib cambridge or any other curriculum over 5000 amazing lectures across maths science english and social science our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests. Performance analysis along with actionable feedback. Personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You also get amazing prizes like PlayStations, iPads, watches and many more. Along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So at deltastep.com 
learning is not just fun and easy, it's rewarding too. So register for free now.